Is real estate the best investment one can make today? Believe it or not, there is a definitive answer to this question, and it is, wait for it, yes. Yes, real estate is the best investment one can make today, tomorrow, next week, or any time in the future, in my opinion. In addition, it is my opinion that right now is one of the best times in history to buy real estate. Episode 94 of the Martini Mortgage Podcast will highlight why real estate is the best investment one can make. This is the Martini Mortgage Podcast with Kevin Martini. Welcome. My name is Kevin Martini, and I am not just the host of the Martini Mortgage Podcast. I'm also the Senior Mortgage Strategist and Branch Manager of the Martini Mortgage Group at Benchmark Mortgage, which is located in Raleigh, North Carolina. Weekly, we curate this mortgage podcast to simply and effectively communicate the opportunity that buying a home and getting a mortgage is. Yes, myself and my business partner and fellow mortgage strategist, Logan Martini, help families in the Raleigh area and all over the great state of North Carolina and the Commonwealth of Virginia too. But this content of this episode is timely and timeless for anyone wanting to buy a home and get a home loan in any state in the U.S., Let's start mixing up this cocktail and talk about the question. Is real estate the best investment one can make today? Obviously, my answer is yes, but what do Americans think? Gallup, in 2019, shared that real estate still leads stocks as the best investment. A Porch.com survey asked, what people thought was the safest investment over the next 10 years, and Americans overwhelmingly said that real estate is the safest investment. Now, I recall a quote from Andrew Carnegie. It went something like this, and I quote, 90% of all millionaires become so through owning real estate, end quote. He went on to say that it would be wise that a wage earner of today to invest in real estate. This sentiment was true then, and I believe it is true now. I believe with all of my heart that buying a home to live in as your primary residence is not optional, but required for all, especially since this is the only investment that I know about that you can actually live in. You cannot live in a stock or a bond. You buy and call it home as an added bonus when purchasing the right place. Typically, the right place will continue to appreciate. To me, buying is smarter than renting. On the aggregate, Real estate consistently increases in value over the passage of time and historically has outperformed other asset classes. This is why I believe that it is always good to buy real estate. Believe it or not, the barrier of entry is very low for one buying a primary residence. Some of the families that Logan and I work with can be in a home for less than the cost of the first and the last and the security deposit of a rental unit. Listen, people need a place to live. Some will rent that place and some will own that place. I help people own it and create wealth during the process. Now, I know, I get it, I can imagine what you're thinking. Real estate has been going up every year Right now, it's too expensive to buy a home, and that is why you are renting right now. I believe that's a limiting belief. What I'm going to share with you next is going to blow your mind, so if you're driving and listening to this podcast, please grip that steering wheel very tightly. As a buyer, you must not be concerned about the price, but instead, 
the long-term cost of the home. Technically, it is less expensive today to buy a home than it was a year ago. This is not a crazy statement. This is 100% fact. Yep, the cost of homes have gone up. And in recent time, they've gone up and every year that median priced home has gone up yearly. However, mortgage interest rates are at historic levels today and they have been dropping since November 2018. According to Freddie Mac's primary mortgage survey, on January 3rd, 2019, the 30-year fixed average rate nationally was 4.51%. On January 2nd, 2020, the average 30-year fixed rate nationally was 3.72%. That is huge, folks. Whenever a mortgage rate is reduced by a quarter, then buying power of a consumer is increased by 2.5%. So is real estate the best investment you can make? I think so, especially since money to buy that real estate is on sale right now. And as you know, sales do not last forever. Now, let me be transparent. I have no idea where home values are going to be in the future. However, the big four, the big four are Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac, the National Association of Realtors, and the Mortgage Bankers Association all believe that home values will keep rising and rising and rising. Now, let me be honest. Most likely, the level of appreciation is not going to go as high as it has in the past, but nobody said that the numbers will actually slide back. So perhaps not at the level that we were, but there's a fact. Homes later will be most likely cost you more. In addition, most likely the mortgage rate will be higher. So buying sooner than later could reap some amazing economic gains. Let me say this to you one more time. When buying a home, you must not be concerned about the price, but instead the long-term cost. And the long-term cost is determined by the mortgage rate if you're getting a mortgage. Right now, the long-term costs are low and you can lock in your housing costs with a fixed rate mortgage. Now, if I had to write a check every month, I personally believe it's better to write it to a mortgage company than to send it to my landlord. Buying a home does not need to tie up a ton of cash either. I have found that people overestimate the credit score that is needed to buy a home and secure a mortgage, and they have also overestimated the amount of money needed for down payment. One of my six financial benefits of owning a home is leverage. Housing is one of the only leverage investments still available today. Simply put, leverage is the use of borrowed money to increase your return. My suggestion is you check out episode 93 of the Martini Mortgage Podcast for the other five financial benefits of owning a home. I bet you will not know all of them and listen it could impact your future very positively. In closing, Back to my question and the title of the Martini Mortgage Podcast. Is real estate the best investment one can make today? It is my opinion it is. I want to highlight this fact. When you buy real estate, you will not always have a monthly housing payment. However, if you rent, you will. When you own real estate one day, that mortgage will be paid off. To me, owning real estate provides stability. And in my opinion, real estate is one of the best investments ever. When buying a home, it never matters how big that house is. All that matters is how happy the home is. Speaking of happy, 
to make the process stress-free and frictionless, one should always follow the steps. It's always loan first and then go find your home. I know it sounds simple, but sadly, several people do not follow these right steps. When you focus on the economics first, when you focus on having cost and price clarity first, it allows you to be a viper in the market and you're able to share with the seller that you are not just ready and willing. You are ready, willing, and able, and you can say, let's do this. Thank you for tuning in and please share this episode of the Martini Mortgage Podcast with someone that you care about or that might benefit from the content. If you or someone you know has questions, I invite you to call me, Kevin Martini at 919-238-4934. The Martini Mortgage Group makes real estate dreams a reality with trusted advice in a stress-free environment with great rates and on-time closings while providing a world-class experience. If you or someone you know has questions about the current mortgage rates or the current mortgage programs, please reach out to the Martini Mortgage Group at 919-238-4934. The information contained in this podcast presentation is for general product information purposes only. Arklatex Financial Services, LLC, and MLS number 2143, doing business as Benchmark Mortgage, makes no representations or warranties of any kind expressed or implied about the completeness, reliability, suitability, or availability with the respect to the information, products, or services. All loans subject to borrower qualifying. Other restrictions may apply. Branch Manager Kevin Martini, NMLS number 143962. Branch located at 5650 Six Forks Road, Suite 101, Raleigh, North Carolina, 27609. Contact the branch by calling 919-238-4934. Equal housing opportunity.